Hey, every... Oh, there's a recording. Hi, everybody. Welcome to the stream. It's your boy, Fantasy Sauce Luigi, back for another exciting Tomba stream. This time we're playing... We're starting up Tomba 2, the game that I wanted to play from the beginning, but figured I'd have to play Tomba 1 first to give people context or something. I don't know. Um, Yeah, we're starting up Tomba 2. It'll probably just be me all, uh, all stream today, but maybe Penelope will, will hop in. Hey, Smudge. Big ol' O slash to you two. Um, if you like what you see here, consider subscribing. We'd uh, and we'd love your support. Smudge over here uh, made me eat three big ol' spoonfuls of uh, cookie dough yet last night, and uh, yeah, it was it was actually pretty great. See, the the problem with the cookie dough is is that uh, you have to make me eat a lot of it in order to uh, actually make me feel regret. You'll do it again? All right, go for it. Commit this time. Uh, if you, so yeah, consider dropping your bits here, you know, your Twitch Prime subs, if there's any primers in chat, you know, that sort of thing. Uh, we have a Discord channel, a Discord server, excuse me, where you can join and interact with fun people like Smudge. And uh, of course, if you want to see our streams, our past streams, uh, you can check out our Fantasy Sauce YouTube channel. That's where I upload all of our streams in the highest quality I can manage. With that said, uh, we're going to hop into the game. This is going to be a pretty chill stream. Uh, I'm not I'm not super high energy today. You guys don't have to be either, but uh, either way, I appreciate you for being here. Feel free to relax, lurk if you want to, and uh, we're going to enjoy some Tomba. This is this this game will go a lot smoother than the other one though. I'm certain of it. Anyways, let's get started. Oh shit. Hang on. Uh my stream deck presets are wrong for this. I need to switch to my four by three. There we go. Alright, fixed it. Here we go. Tomba two. Sony. Hmm. For those of you wondering, we are using Retro Arch. Uh, out of the different options I could find, this was the one that gave us the best uh, upscaling. It's not even upscaling, really. It's just rendering it at a higher resolution. So, um, that's why the game's gonna look excellent. Oh, we gotta watch the intro animation, right? Look at these JPEGs on screen. Hell yeah. There's at least a hundred pixels there. Incredible. Alright, the monkey's involved now, by the way. Charlie, Charles or whatever. They're playing golf with eggs, I guess. Seems ill-advised. Oh, all right. Tomba got the egg. Tomba gonna... No, Tomba's not gonna eat the egg. This is anime. What the fuck? Oh, all right. Sure. Monkey. Hey, Charles. Charlie. I Was it Charles or Charlie? I don't remember. Okay. Isn't that the mailbox that was outside of the mansion in Tomba 1? Oh, okay, that was it. That was very little context. All right. Uh, Tomba 2, the evil swine return. Uh, okay. <laughs> Fucking copyright 1997 to 2000. Holy heck. Uh, double check the options. Okay, cool. We can increase the speed. Oh, right. This game has voice acting for everything this time, not just cutscenes. So get excited for that. Uh, also, mo most modern games don't have this shit. At least, or some modern games don't have this shit. But fucking Tomba 2, 
24 years old, or whatever, has the ability to turn down the background music and the special effects. That's huge. I love it. Anyways, uh, we don't need to adjust the screen, and the controls are fine. Yeah. All right, let's get started. Tomba is living peacefully in the country when Zippo finds a mysterious letter addressed to Tomba. Okay. The letter says that who the fuck is Zippo? Tabby has disappeared. As he read the letter, all he could think about was where she could be. Was she kidnapped? Okay. Is she safe? Sure. Determined to bring her back safely, Tomba jumps into the sea. And then? Yeah? Just jumps into the sea? All right. I mean, I guess, I guess we've already established that he can swim from last game. Ah. I don't have to voice act any of this. I can just sit back and let it happen. This is great. Hey, you scared me. What are you doing in the water anyways? Oh my god, dude. Turn down your mic game. You are clipping hard. <laughs> no wonder they weren't fighting. Oh my god. Hmm. Is everybody's voice is gonna clip? Do you smell something burning? Tomba, wait here. I'll go check it out. The music is clipping too. Oh, this isn't ideal. All right, uh, first person view. Look at how 3D this game is. It's great. Oh, By the way, oh. if you were like me as a kid and and just skip this cutscene to get to the game, oh boy, you regretted it. <laughs> I <laughs> I spent I'm, I just distinctly remember as a kid spending like over an hour trying to figure out this one section because I didn't know what the fuck I was supposed to do. God, I was impatient. Oh, look. House is on fire. Yeah, it is. Wow, huh? Which one's the circle button? That one. And it looks like there's something inside the house. I would hope so. It's not just an empty building, is it? If we don't do something, it'll burn to a crisp. The, the house or the thing inside? All right, whatever. Oh hell yeah! Look at that! I love these. I love the animations in this game. This unknown territory here. Before we go, we better take this. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Just unzips his pants. This is an adventure journal. This, this is an adventure journal. Okay. Press triangle to see. Should I turn off the voices? Hey Smudge or whoever's in chat. Let's hurry. We need to go to the house on fire. Would you guys would you guys find it better to listen to the to the recorded voices or listen to me voice everything? Love to know. You can run faster. Yeah, you? I know that. I've played the, the game before this one. All right. Uh, so it's still basically like a 2D side scroller, but now the environment is 3D. So like the 2D planes are intersect and stuff. It's way better. Just a big fan of it overall. Uh, yes, we're safe. Uh... What the hell? Oh, I think this was just my test run. Yeah, we'll save over it. This is fine. Alright, it's faster too, which is nice. You get the animal dash right away, which is also nice. And I'll be honest, it feels less floaty, like way more controllable. So I'm I'm a big fan. Uh, I think there's just fish fishermen in here, which just give you hints. Hi. Oh, okay. Things you picked up are under items. Events that have happened are under events. Your status is and system. The journal records it all. Sound, that voice just sounds like somebody who'd go um actually a lot. Within an area, there are places where you can move forward and backwards. Oh, okay. In places where... Yeah. Here's a little extra tip. Don't forget. Cool. I wonder how much these voice actors actually got paid. <laughs> I suspect those two guys got like one line each and that's it. 
All right. Voice like sounds sounds like someone hates their job. Yeah, you're gonna get that a lot in this game. I don't think voice actors uh, tended to, you know, get much work at this stage in, in the in the game. I got a fish! A rare fish. Ooh. Hell yeah. Oh, I found a bird's nest. Alright. Mmm, sip, sip, sip. Oh, already? Hey, Yodi. Oh, shit. Next time, I gotta pause the game. Streech! Alright. Oh, stretching. It's it's all good. Thanks for the stretch and the and the hydrate. Oh no, the pig's stuck under the the thingy. Well, that's unfortunate for the pig. Oh no, never mind. The pig figured it out. All right, I'm gonna kind of breeze through this first section because I remember basically all of it. Um, it's all super straightforward. And I totally didn't play through it at least like five times as part of my uh, my testing of the game. Back when I was figuring out if I would actually play this or not. Also, I'm just immediately feeling the nostalgia from the uh, soundtrack. Hello? The birds are supposed to go in the nest right... Oh, I just wasn't lining up properly. Also, wasn't one of those red? Why are they both blue? They... That's weird. <laughs> no, like, for real. They're always... There's always one red, one blue. Why are they now both blue? Oh, is it... Does it have to do with the color that's, like, on top or something? When you, uh, when you, like, rotate the thingies, maybe? That'd be weird. Oops. Oops. Alright, we got a bucket. This will work for carrying the water? Yeah, it will. Seriously, Zippo, where the fuck did you come from? And why are you here? <laughs> You were not in the previous game. We've established this. It's weird. No. Go away. Ooh. Thank you kindly. Oh, there's a crab in the window. Oh, no! They're getting baked. Yep, but not in a good way. Yep. Penelope's not here, so I gotta do it for her. All right. Uh, oh, how did I miss that? What the hell? God damn it. Hang on. again. There we go, got one. All right. So there's a couple things I got to do with the uh, with a bucket of water in, in, in this area. So I'm going to do one of those first. It's not really a quest or anything, but I might as well. Got to water the plant. The burning building can wait. You know, honestly... I feel like they're overreacting just a little bit. <laughs> Gotta get all the jams. Damn, I can't reach that one. 
All right, let's go give this old man a, uh, a bucket of water, I guess. Hi, old man. Uh, doot doot. Oh, that one. Here's hoping this game doesn't have any quests that we can accidentally softlock like the last one. Whoa, slow down there. Are you trying to put the fire out? Leave that to an adult. How? How old is Tomba? Like, canonically. This can't be, I mean, this can't have happened right after the previous game, right? All right. Like, it must have been a couple years, maybe? That. He's got to be older than he was before, right? I mean, his voice certainly got deeper. Uh oh, this isn't enough. Wow, it's almost as if a single bucket of water isn't enough to put out a house fire. We Would you look at that? Bucket of water. Oh, only one more? Oh, okay. I'll get you one more bucket of water. I do appreciate the menu. Like, everything about this game is way more polished than the previous game. All right, yeah, I'm giving you it. Take it. Take it, old man. Take it. Ouch! Oh. Hot, hot, hot. All right, dude's gonna need his life alert soon. You need some cooling off. Oh shit! Dude thinks he's an action hero. I have to bring out the one-liner. Hooray! We saved the crab. Fuck off, Zippo! I don't need you here. <laughs> well, thank goodness the crab is saved. You d fucking Zippo's a I discount spark, a there. or whatever the fuck the uh, the dragonfly is in um in uh, Spyro. Uh, yeah, my name's. My name is Zippo. This is my friend Tom. Don't speak for me, you bitch. We stumbled on this place when we were looking for the coal mining town. Wait, what? Why are we looking for the coal mining town? Hold on, I'm confused. Hmm, the coal mining town. You should be able to get there. There's a few the plot holes way. here. All right, windmill shed. Just cross the net bridge over the valley ahead. You'll see a place called the Great Waterfall. Okay, so what you're telling me is it's a net bridge, not a gross bridge. What's can. I don't I don't understand or remember the difference. Can you can you tell explain to me what the difference is there? Of the heavens. Oh, he that was a big pause. All right. That. When? He's the boat builder of this town. He's also the caretaker for the windmill shed. Okay. Oh, by the way, if you're going to Wind's windmill shed, can you give him the crab we rescued? All right. I guess we're giving him a crab. You ever just have an old man go, hey, can you give this guy crabs for me? Thanks. This is a golden crab. Wynn wants to use it for something. Yeah, all right. If you bring it to him, Wynn should be willing to help you. Yeah. Okay, thanks, old man. <laughs> I am called Kynan. Actually, Kynan. I was just on a trip, too. All right. Maybe we'll meet again sometime. Hmm. Oh, yeah, here's your bucket back. It's probably useful for more than just water. All right, fair. I have yet to see an indication that the Tomba 1 save data has actually been registered by the game yet or not. I guess we'll, we'll find out. If if it doesn't, I don't really fucking care. Uh, here's a bucket. Yeah, I know. Do the same thing if you want to put it in... Yeah, all right, cool, thanks. Is that all the stuff I can do here? I think so. So this game, this this has the exact same gameplay loop as Tomba One, just uh, with a way nicer, um, 
well, graphical upgrade, basically. Are the fish in the... No, they're not in the pond yet. All right. Magic wings are the charity wings from the previous game. Oh, is that a mouse door? What the hell? All right. Everyone keep your eyes open for some secret Mickeys. Please don't talk to me right now. I'm trying to find that star-shaped cog that goes to the bridge. Okay. Let's see. I had it when I went to the dry net. That was the last time I saw it. Uh, the, that's, that, there's where you went, uh, wrong, my dude. You needed a drying pan, not a drying net. Oh, alright, cool. Here, have the cog. You have it? Great! Now I can finally raise the bridge! God, every single voice is clipping and crackling, and I hate it. That's definitely not my fault, though. Like, for real. It's... It was in the original game too. I remember I remember it as I was a kid. From when I was a kid. I don't have any fingers, my dude. Do you not see these slabs that are my hands? Okay, it's up. You did I mean the sprite art look was pretty cool, gotta admit. Sure, it's not my fault. Oh no, Smudge is blaming me. You can cross the bridge now. Look out for the golden crab, though. If you get too close, they'll bite you unless you have a crab basket. They're pretty nasty critters. What do they do if you have a crab basket? Do they? What do they do? O old man, you're not you're not answering my question. Water, baskets are for crabs. Don't get confused. Okay, sure. The crab basket? Yeah? That's right, a crab basket. I believe I saw a winged pig with one not too long ago. Okay, but what do the crabs do if you have a crab basket? <laughs> okay then, first, let's go get that crab basket. Nobody's answering my question! <laughs> Alright, whatever. The joke is stupid. God, I hate Zippo. Oh, actually, wait, I just realized. Tomba has uh, his grandpa's bracelet from the first game. I wonder, I I never recognized that before, but I didn't really know the plot of the first game before, so I guess it's whatever. All right, it's up there now. All right, so there's... There's our first AP, uh, oh, there we go, uh, box. What's this? Uh, 30,000. All right. Oh, AP stands for Adventurer's Points. It definitely wasn't clear f before. Uh, also, this game, I don't have to be as uh, liberal with saves and save states because this game lets you just fucking continue if you die. God, what a novel concept. Hey, Hunter. Welcome back. Your message is blank. I don't... Oh, never mind. It loaded. She just needed a second. Hey, Hunter. <laughs> oh, hey, we haven't gotten a, uh, a bot yet today. Well, that's nice. Also, I don't think there's very many insta-death areas uh, in this game. Like that? That would have killed you in the first game, but nope. Single health. Nice and easy. Oh, I need to get the crab basket. Hang on. Alright, we're up here. Okay. Oh, there's a white chest up there. All right, we gotta remember that. Chat, write that down. We have, there's a white chest back here. That'll be uh, useful for something, I'm sure. We got a spoon. I don't know. I don't know why I want a spoon, but we got it. I missed. I forgot. 
how annoying this area of the game is. <laughs> All right, so I was I was pushing just left before. Let's try left and up. Nope, it didn't work. I did finish Tombo One. You're right. I beat it last, uh, well, two days ago. Okay. Okay. Where'd the music go? Is it just, it's just waterfall sound. Oh, there's the music. Crab! Got the crab. Oh! Shit. You missed it? Ah, oh, beans. Well, good news is, is that uh, that stream's already up on YouTube, so you can... Go and watch it if you want to uh, catch up on it. All right. So if I can't, I don't. I can't get enough speed to go that way. So I have to just navigate this again. This is still kind of an annoying part of uh, this game. You know, one wrong step and I'm dead. That's all right, though. I'm an expert. I'm an expert on a closed course. Do not try this at home. Or whatever. Oh, red chest. I appreciate also that they didn't use, like, you know, a hundred-year-old, thousand-year-old or whatever for this one. They just, uh, they just made them different colors. Makes it way... Way simpler. Get get over here, crab. Oh, this crab. Got him. All right, we got the golden crabs. How did I know there were three of them? I don't know. Why are you asking so many silly questions? And then we uh, do that. Cool. You're welcome. Oh, it smudges the bot? Ah, oh, shit. Crab has hands beating you up. Yeah. Oh, I just got a... What did I just get? Got the bird clothes. <laughs> Wait, they just gave me the parasol? Right away? Hey, the fish hook's gone. All right, cool. I'm I'm not gonna question it. It's gonna make my life so much easier. I can't believe it. It was a gift. Oh my gold fisher. Oh, okay. So there's golden items in this game too. Uh. All right, cool. We got the bird clothes. Oh, it actually does like a. Okay, cool. Neat. All right, uh, well, we're now finished with the first area, and it only took that long. That was it. <laughs> I, think, I think that would have taken me like three hours when I was a kid. So, uh, hey, we are 30 minutes into the stream, and we've already uh, passed the first area. You got it? Thank you so much. Hurry, put it in the water. All right, here's your golden crabs. All right, keep keep your eyes on the screen, everyone. Fire. Shit's about to get weird. Fire. If you don't mind me asking, Win, what do you do with them? What do we do with the crabs? It's a great question. Watch and see. This invention is one of a kind. All right, now keep an eye on his invention and uh, tell me what notes you have. Ready, set, go! Okay, so it pops the uh, water bubbles. The crabs then, for some reason, climb up the sides of the thing. It cut. They cut the rope. The fan falls down. Right? Okay. Uh, they return to their, like, fan shape or whatever. 
Uh, the fans start spinning, right? You following so far? All the crabs are just getting spun up, including us. All right, it's going up. Uh, the crabs are gone. It uh, grinds in the ceiling. And uh, stone blocks fall down. It works! It works! We finally have a shortcut to the next town! Yep, that, that, that was his intention, was apparently he wanted to cut up the ceiling and turn it into blocks. I mean, ingenious invention, right? Just absolutely the best. The fuck? Why was the fan up on the ceiling in the first place? Cool. It was what were the what were the what was the point of the crabs? Steps out of stone. I must say, when you are truly a genius. This guy feels like uh, when you when you were a kid and you took all the soap bottles and mixed it together in in the in the bathtub to make a potion. It was like, yeah, you 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 do that. I'm so proud of you. You're so ingenious. The oh, fuck? Sorry. Uh, so where are you headed? We're going to the coal mining town. The coal mining town. In that case, take this stairway. Also, I wasn't the only kid that did that, right? Aren't you glad you met a man of such intelligence? Be careful when you go there, though. There's an evil pig spell in that area. I recall talking to some miners. Actually, now that I think about it, I'm shocked that my parents did not get super angry at me for wasting soap. <laughs> I was allowed to just do that. Wild. Something called cappers, okay. Well, I'm off to brag to Ark about my latest invention. <laughs> Ark's just like, I'm sorry, you use the crabs for what? <laughs> Wait a minute, that voice. Yeah, we heard it like five minutes ago. Come on, keep up, Zippo. Well, it looks like I was just in time. Okay. Old man, did you go through the obstacle course that I went through? How? How did you get through that? This red key should help you on your adventures. Hooray! First key acquired! Red key acquired. It can open up all the red chests oh, shit, scattered that, throughout the land. You telling me, uh, Hunter, you telling me that the old man just no-clipped? Is, is that what happened? Just turned on god mode? Treasure chests? But the red key... You yep. need to find a key with the same color. Yeah. I only have the red one, so good. Okay. Thank you very much. Cool. Anytime. See you soon. <laughs> No, that was a ho ho ho, not a ha ha ha. Come on, voice actor, get with it. Oh, wait, I didn't want to go that way. There's a red chest in there. Alright, let's go get all the red chests. It's probably worth it. Oh, we have the fast pants. Best part, the game automatically equips them. We don't ha even have to worry about it. God, I love this game. Look at us, just flying around. We're speedy. Up. Oh. Okay. Uh huh. Nailed it. Look at this. The physics. The way that it, that that it just uh, you know, like bobs up and down as you're sw swinging. It's so good. Oh, okay. There's a blue chest right there. Also, what? Oh, the hole, the hole behind the waterfall. All right. Other side of the waterfall, five thousand. It's a shortcut. I don't, I don't, I don't get what you're not getting here. It's a shortcut. Come on, people, keep up. Uh oh. Okay, the flying is limited. It does not last forever. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> Whoops. There we go. 
So next we go over here. Up. Oh. I meant to do that. That was intentional. Can I? Can I look up? Can I like see where I'm? Okay, I'll be honest. The fact that the flying suit doesn't last forever is tripping me up pretty horribly. Like the bird clothes. They just kind of like end and it's it's causing me some trouble. I sh I uh I'm not so sure if I should keep using them. Oh, it's not. Oh, I got to go the other way to wind it up. Oh, that's unfortunate. Okay. I bet you have to go left again. Oh, missed it. All right, we're fine. Okay. Isn't there like a red chest up here somewhere? No, that one's green. Oh, there's a gold gem right up there. Okay. Cool. Up. Oh, that's spiky. Be mindful of the spiky rock. Uh, that's a blue chest down there. Okay. Okay. I, I immediately was like, the game is not floaty. And then I t turned on the floaty, uh, the floaty clothes. You know what? Let's not do that. All right. We got, we got a half of a, of a life container. So, uh, that's good. We're going to see if we can get more of those. Because, uh, I'm bad at video games. Hey, I will take a lot of damage in this game. Yep. Oh, thank you for the yip. Hey, chives. How's your day going? Did you have good food? Because I, I remember the last message you sent me uh, in, in, on Discord was that uh, you were eating food. And so I'm like, okay. So how was the food? Ho oin. Ho oin to you as well. Oh, I don't have the bird clothes on anymore. <laughs> oh no, I've gotten used to them. There's another pot of life. Cool. Making good progress. Last night was great. Me and boyfriend got burritos. Fuck yeah. I think I had burritos for dinner last night too. God, burritos are great. You just get like a couple pounds of food for very little money. Oh my god, you got- oh, you got- that's right, you're in Canada, so you're probably seeing the exact same- was it Burrito Guys? Bar Burrito, okay. Because I- I had- I gotta- I gotta buy one, get one for, uh, from- on Uber Eats as well. So I've got, I had two, got two burritos. I, uh, I've, I'm saving one for today and, uh, I ate the other one. It was great. Actually, maybe mine was bar burrito. I know I've eaten from bar burrito before. Hang on. Let me double check. I'm, I, I'm now, I'm no gaslighting myself. Calgary and Toronto are like different worlds. They're really not. They really aren't. Also, I'm not in Toronto. I want to make that clear. I cannot live in a, in a city that dense. Uh, no, mine was burrito, guys. But there are bar burritos here. Okay. On to the next town! 
This is the, this is as far as I got in my testing of the game. So from here on out, I am flying only on information from when I was a child. Oh God, things are on fire. That's not good. Pipe area, no shit. You'd rather not live in Calgary? It's too big for you? Same. All right. You grew up in a little town of 1,300, so it's a big change. I grew up in a town, a city of uh, a couple hundred thousand. Uh, but even still, that's... Toronto is a whole different ballgame. Oh, I'm gonna need a- I'm gonna need more buckets of water. All right, let's go get more water. I sped up the CD read speed so that the uh, the game just like loads super fast. Even still, I, I there's still a loading screen, which just kind of bugs me. Oh no, I just realized I have to go through this whole fucking gauntlet every single time I want to go get water. God damn it. Wait, is there something up there? I thought I saw... Oh, there is! What is that? Alright, that's weird. Huh. Actually, if, if we want to be specific, I grew up in a small town directly adjacent to a, a big city. So, like, I, I had all of the amenities within, like, a five-minute drive. But my immediate surroundings were actually quite, uh, you know, ordinary. If that makes sense. I gotta admit, I I'm kind of love hating the uh, the the bird clothes because uh, they're they're sort of screwing me up at, at times. Okay, I got some water. Uh, oh yeah, hour and a half away from Edmonton. Yeah, basically same for me, except I was like there. There's no gap between where I was and uh, and the the big city. Well, big city in quotation marks. I think it's probably more like a normal sized city because big city is more like Toronto. Even still, it was nice to uh, not be far from the biggest mall in the region. You know. There we go. Of course, uh, you had the bigger mall. You had a much bigger mall. <laughs> Although, uh, fun fact, my dad actually was one of the people uh, that was like on the construction crew for uh, the West Edmonton Mall. Back when he lived out the, in, the, in that area. That was like early on in his life, of course. Oops. Okay. Now will this work? No. Hmm. Damn it. Oh shit. Okay, maybe don't die, Tomba. Uh, is there like another way to do this? Did I, am I fucking this up? All right, well, I guess there's something else I gotta do there. That's not the answer. That was when I was around, so very different time. Oh wait, your dad did welding projects for West Dad. Yeah, I get you. Water. Oh, hey, I got water. You want some water? I got water for you. Give him the water, Tomba. Give him the shampoo. 
Just dump it over his head. And... <laughs> no. No, my dad did not build the sea lion prison under the mall. I don't. I didn't even know there was a sea lion prison under the, under the mall. That sounds. Uh, that sounds horrible. If you're a sea mm. lion. Hmm. Thank you. You saved me. You're welcome. I've got to pay you back somehow. Oh no, you really don't have to. Hmm. I've got it. All right. I'll give you some information. It's supposed to be a secret, of course. Oh, cool. You say you're going to pay me back, and then you just tell me something. No, do you have any cash? Have you ever heard of the Tower of Courage? No. Sounds well, like a fake place. About a legendary tower that nobody can find anymore. Oh, great. I gave you water, then you rewarded me with a fucking legend. A story. A storybook story. In fact, I am on a journey looking for that very tower. The greatest reward, knowledge. I thought the greatest reward was books. I feel like the knowledge is secondary to the paper and, you know, leather. There are all sorts of rumors about the fabulous treasures hidden in that tower. Yeah? What do you think? Isn't it enough to stir your blood? Oh my god, he paid me with gossip. My dude? You suck. Water for a story seems like an equal trade. Sure. Depends on uh, the value of the water, though. You know, scarcity and all. Ah! He hit me with the pink mist. Oh, no. It's game over. Oh, no. I'm lo I've lost all my progress. Oh, wait. No, I didn't. Fucking... Gotta love how far this game has come from Tombo 1. I get to continue, too. I don't even have to, like, load my save data or anything crazy like that. It's just... It just happened. Up. Oh. Isn't that fantastic, guys? There's some sort of mechanism it won't open. Well, shit. I don't know, then. What's in... What's here? Lowering the chain makes the other chain rise. Lower it all the way and lift it up to bring the up clumps of mud. I need more water. I remember this. The clumps of mud need to be combined with the uh, water in order to, uh... Yeah. Shit. All right. God, look at that chain. That's not a clump of mud. That's a... What is that, a throwing star? A blackjack? Oh, hey, look, another mouse door. We found another secret Mickey, everyone. I assume going into the fire is a bad idea, right? Yep, yep, it's a bad idea. Okay, good to know. Tomba has a sequel. I thought this was Tomba 1. No, we, we played Tomba 1 already. We're now playing Tomba 2. Keep up. Oh, come on, Tomba. Catch the fucking thing. You suck. Tomba, you're the worst. Oh, that whole chain's on fire, huh? All right. Rude. Hmm. How much AP do we got, by the way? Oh, wait, we can go back and open up that AP chest. Cool, let's go do that. We can get some water while we're there, too. My, my boyfriend is telling me that he was just throwing cinder blocks at a wrench to loosen a bolt? What? I feel like... I, I mean, it's a very gremlin thing to do, first off, which I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to judge him for, but also, <laughs> I feel like there's more effective ways to loosen a bowl. <laughs> like, maybe just get a pipe. Just, you know, 
Get get more leverage. He's a sweetie gremlin. I've heard. We got a pig nose panel. Whatever that whatever that is. Hey, the food respawns. Can you believe it? It's almost like this game has uh, evolved. It's an actual, like, fun time like, for once. Oh my god. You know what? The bird clothes aren't doing it for me. Grab the fish, Tomba. Thank you. I want the fish. Grab the fish. All right, take off the bird clothes. All right, the transformation sequence is a bit much every time. Grab the fish. There we go. Uh, sort. There we go. All right, we got some water. No magical girl's transformation for me, though. No, sorry. You mean you're allowed to gush about your boyfriend? I'm sure he he appreciates it. Oh, right. No, I need to hit the handle. I make that mistake every time. You have no idea the floodgates you will awaken? Okay, you know what? Maybe I won't. I think you're right. like pour water on these guys, right? Like that's not a thing I can do. Oh, I can. <laughs> cool. I wasted my bucket of water. God damn it, Tomba. Damn it. That sucks. This was the era of how do we make 3D games, but it's, it's, this game seemed to hit it pretty well. To be fair though, the, uh, the, this game was, uh, you know, rendered at a significantly lower resolution than it is being rendered right now. On top of the fact that like this, this emulator is doing a lot of hard work to make this look good. So, uh, I don't know. You, you could, you could, you could say one thing or another about how, uh, how good this actually is. Oh, all right. We got some water. Cool. Fuck you, pig. Oh, ad break. You don't see 2.5D games anymore? I really don't. Oh, shit. God damn it. I can't wait until we can swim. Then I don't have to be damaged by water every time I jump into it accidentally. Ad break's coming up, everyone. So, uh, you know, if you aren't subscribed, just sit through it. We'll be back. I'll, I'll be sure to pause the game so that you don't miss anything. 
You are immune. That's true. You get to hang out with me while I figure out what to do for three minutes without the game running. How, how do I live without constantly doing something with my hands? You know? All right. Oh, no. Oh, no, indeed, Yodi. Oh, no, indeed. Mm. Yep. Oh, thank you for the yip. No need to get rowdy. Good stretch. That was a free stretch, by the way. No need to redeem your points for that one. Oh, man. So, Chives, you're... You're a fan of torturing me sometimes. What do you, uh... What do you think? Should I... On the... In the vein of the cookie dough sort of thing, what what would you, uh... What would you like to see Samantha? me drink or eat for, for uh... Donations? Oh, there's the bot. It's not exclusive to you. I know. I know. I'm, I, I'm, I'm just saying. You've got experience with that shit. Gotta add a yip that's a, like a 1 in 1,000 chance of it just being a goofy scream. <laughs> yeah -ha -ha What, something like that? Problem is, is it's, uh, it, it's very hard to make something 1 in 1,000 for that sort of thing. Like, the, the system is not there for it. Penelope finally uh, tried Buckley's? Heck yeah. Your boyfriend and you got a big pack of Japanese Kit Kats. Oh yeah, I've, I've heard that they've got like a massive number of like different flavors of Kit Kats. If, uh, if the Game Grumps video is anything to go by. Yeah, exactly. They've got all sorts of odd flavors. I hate that I have to report like a bot every single stream. Twitch, get your shit together. Honestly speaking, I should just like blacklist the phrase cheap viewers on. You know what? I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna blacklist that that phrase. Here, uh, let's let's see. How do I do that? How do I do that? Um Moderation. Here we go. Blocked terms and phrases. There we go. All right. It's blocked. Uh, they have all sorts of other flavors. There's lychee, salt, tea, matcha. I know a matcha. Uh, the worst is lychee. It's very gross. Interesting. Hmm. I mean, they are the ones that, like, have a whole bunch of different weird ice cream flavors, too. Like, green tea ice cream and stuff like that. Although I get the sense that, um, that's just a, a westernized, you know, bastardized version of Asian culture. But whatever. Damn, can't even make jokes? No, you can't. To be fair, it'll save me a whole bunch of effort. Alright, back to the game. You, yeah, Chives hit the last one. Good, congratulations, Chives. Uh-oh. Excuse me, windbag. Could you stop? Thank you. I think when I was playing this this game as a child, it took me a while to get the bird clothes. Up. Oh. Alright, that did nothing. Hmm. 
<laughs> Best viewers for sale on ass, comma, com. All right, sure. Whatever you... I don't have the bird clothes on. I don't have the bird clothes on. <laughs> Whoops. Just, just, just jumped in the lava. <laughs> well, that was a mistake. Yeah, sure, I'll save. I don't mind. That sounds like a good idea. Boy, I can't wait for the the end of the game it to be like, you died 50,000 times. I'm gonna be like, oh shit, I'm getting called out. Viewers on onlybleats.com? What? All right. I mean, can't argue with you on that one. Never, never been on onlybleats myself. I need that life. I gotta try and get. I didn't make it. Wow, it's just a game. That's an auto game over, huh? All right. Shit. No, we're not going to save. It takes too long. There's no point in before I uh, accidentally over, uh, you know, quit the game and then lose all my save data. All right, where are we he where are we heading? Uh, oh, I could try to jump over this boyo, but he seems to be quite a flame. Hmm. Sir. Would you kindly stop? God damn it. All right, this is fine. Okay, nothing that way. Wow, all right, there's some fire pigs now. Those exist. Oops. All right. Up. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. All right, we're good. Oh no, the roof is not a platform. Ah. Uh. So I need to get the item on that, right? And the only way to do that is to pull the chain from the, oh, hey, there's something up there. Hold on, what's up there? Nailed it. Oh, we got a mud ball surprise. Can't you can't you combine things? Clump of mud with something inside. I thought I could combine it with the, with the bucket of water. Maybe that's not, that's later. Sure, why not? I'll just leave it that sorted like that. Deer dot yip. Ah, oh, shit. What, you don't want a mud ball surprise? Use the spoon on it. Shit, you right. Of course, that's the only way to do it. Oh, hell yeah, we got another pot of life. More life. Oh, I remember. There's like a mud washing station uh, somewhere in the game. So that's how you uh, that that's how you get the mud balls. The item that's in the mud in the mud, basically. Um. Yeah. Okay. So we gotta keep our eyes open for that on it. Uh, uh, that thingy. Gotta make sure you have a nice clean mud. Exactly. Oh, that uh, blob of fire went to sleep or something. All right. You pig! God damn it. Oh, we got the ice boot. Up! Oh, up! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. 
Stop blowing at me. Cool, we got the ice boomerang. Which means... Yeah, I can do that. Remove all the cappers. I guess that's a thing we can do now. Cool. They got the bird claws! Kill the kill the the duder. The duder right there. Alright, that worked. Hooray! We're making progress! Once again, though, like, if, if I, as a child, I didn't, like, watch that cutscene, so I just, I didn't know that I had to get that, uh, the ice boomerang. <laughs> it was, god, I was, it really sucked as a kid to, like, not have any sort of attention span, you know? You gonna wake up? Wake up. Find a way to make another chicken up. Up! Yep. I landed right on the uh, fiery chest. Also, yep. Yeah, game over. No, we're not going to save. Yes, we're going to continue. Cool. Bye. Oh, hey, Errol. Do you think we can get that red chest? We're gonna try it. You bitch! You bitch! Stop blowing on me! God damn it! I gotta fear the. I'm fearing the pink mist. There we go. All right. Uh, I'm gonna put on the bird clothes. And let's see if we can get that red chest. Hit him with the boomer. Nailed it! The fuel that burns well. Oh, so close. Hmm. I missed! Nailed it. What a satisfying thunk. That was pretty great. What's that? Chick food. Feed the chicks. <laughs> that was my uh that was my nickname in prison. It was chick food. No reason. <laughs> Wait, you thought I was gonna say high school? Nah. <laughs> God, that's such a satisfying, like, uncorking sound, though. What was I in for? Tax evasion. You know how it is. I got a banana. I am a banana. Look at me move. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I didn't make it. It's all good. Nice, me too. Sick! Tax evasion buddies! Uh, for legal reasons, I have to say that that was a joke. I do not condone tax evasion. Taxes are important for a society to function. Your two counts of burgle lars larson arsoner? <laughs> Arsony? <laughs> what? Bur burglar arson larcenery. What? So wait, you burgled somebody and larson and committed larceny and and arson at the same time? All at once? Gosh, that's that's highly efficient. Uh 
Uh-oh. No, Tomba! Bad bad cutscene time! I'll get- I'm gonna go in the fire! Tomba! Oh, we're fine. This is your biggest accomplishment? I can imagine. That's, uh, that's pretty impressive. Uh-oh. 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 Okay, timing's bad there. Hang on. Hang on. Let's, uh... Okay, we got another mud ball surprise! Oh, come on! Uh, cool, got him. Fucking pig. Is there anything over here? There's a blue thing! I missed it! Worth it. Oh, whoops. I can't aim downwards while I'm flying? That's bullshit. My, look at this Nordic gentleman right here. He looks very Nordic to me, just saying. Pull and open. Hello there. Welcome to the coal mining town. You're- I just wish you'd be able to see it. Varg Skeletor, Skeletor certainly doesn't, um, doesn't sound very... <laughs> uh... Dude's, dude's like Carrot Top, like very, very high-pitched voice, but a lot of muscle. The fuck? <laughs> Unfortunately, the evil pigs locked our door. And we can't open the door unless we put out the flames on the chain. Yeah, alright. So I gotta go put out the chain flames. I can do that. can't shoot. Oh. Interesting. How do I... Hmm. Tricky. Okay. I need to get down there. Oh, okay. I can just do this. That just broke a... All right. Fair. Oh, there's a save thing there. Nice. Hooray, we opened the door. Oh, never mind. We opened half of the door. Damn it, we don't know what the other half is. All right, that's fine. Uh, yep, laughing door. We know what those do. Don't you worry. I know exactly what those are for. But I want to get to that AP chest, too, because I can, uh, potentially? Um, alright. That was weird. What's, what's in it? Or what's the, uh, it's 100,000. What are we at? We are at 92. We're almost there. Sick nasty. Trolls 
trolley entrance. Oh shit. We gonna get the trolley. Trolley stop. Hello there. I'm repairing this trolley. The wheels fell off earlier today. Oh no. If you want to use it, you'll need a trolley ticket. But you have to wait until it's fixed. Okay. This has to be the best hammer in coal mining town. Can I have it? Beans. This is the trolley stop, all right. But without a trolley license, I can't let you ride. I'm sorry. Are you... Are you Solid Snake? <laughs> Your voice stands out, my dude. That miner with a license is injured. He's resting in the town tool shed. Town tool shed, okay. Well, it looks like I can't go any further that way. All right. Psycho Mantis? Maybe? Just like, that's a very like gruff and gravelly voice. My man. You gotta say it like David Hayter. Oh, Psycho Mantis. Well, like that. I'm. My voice is not cut out for that shit. Gotta go full Edge Lord is is being blocked. That's wild. Huh, Psycho Mantis. How that? How's that? How's that? Does that work for you? Does that do it for you? Oh, the chain just ends. There's nothing at the bottom of the chain. Oh shit. I am off the chain. <laughs> I like that it's all like sad music and then you push a button and it's like, oh, okay, we're back to happy. All right. There are no consequences. All right, so that's that was one of the chains. Where does that other chain go? You know? All right, what's over here? Another flower! Well, good news is I've got water for the flower. Here you go, flower. Take it. Hooray, we got a, we got some more magic wings. What's this? Beware of the hot water. Hit the switch with the hammer to turn on the hot water. All right. Uh, unfortunately, I don't have any hammer except the one that is, well. <laughs> no, it's a stupid joke. Um, didn't we get all of the dudes on the pipes? I thought, I thought we did. So like we're, we should be done that quest. Um, yeah, remove all the cappers. But we d haven't yet. Or do I also just need to kill all of them? I thought, all, I thought the only ones that matter are the ones that are um, on the pipes. Mmm, sip, sip, sip. Oh, all right. Drinking the water. Thank you. Okay. Um... Oh, that other chain goes right there. Oh, okay. No, I can reach that. I can reach that. That's easy, actually. Yeah, 
Yeah, it's right here. All right, doors open. Hooray! Well, thanks to you, we can go home now. Thank you. You're welcome. We don't have much to offer, but please feel free to stay as long as you wish. Thanks, I will live in your basement for the rest of my life. <laughs> Hi, Gran. Long time no see. Excuse you? Oh, we know this person, and their name is Gran. Why, hello there, Zippo. How are you? All right, I guess. Zippo used to run with a, with the tough crowd. <laughs> I'm doing fine. I see, but the town's machines still aren't running. We need to get rid of the cappers. Yeah, I'm working on it. I don't know what Dread, we're missing. Can we still get to Tabby's house? I don't know who Tabby is, but all right. Like, I thought I got rid of all the cappers already. All the pipes are unblocked. Kind of weird. We're almost at 100,000. Then we can go get that chest over there, which is super baller. I'm excited for it. But first, to the town. Oh, shit. Hey, hey, Chives, look. It's... Oh, I can't jump, so it's still only 2.5D. God damn it. I was like, if I can jump here, I, it's a 3D game all of a sudden. But no. It's not. Hi there. The door to the house won't open unless the town's machines are working. Right. So what you're telling me, my dude, is that you've you've set up all of the doors so that they will not open, even in an emergency, unless the, the, the machines are working. There is a term for this. And I hate to say it, it's stupidity, but also it's called a fail close state. And uh, that's bad for things like this. You don't want your engineered solutions to fail closed if it, if it means that somebody pigs, might get trapped. Get under the pipes. I hope it's terrible happened. engineering. Because the evil pigs can't get under, can't get under the pipes, I, have, I hope nothing's happened there. Everyone's dead. They've all burned to death or something. I don't know. I could turn on the analog sticks, but I get the sense that uh, that's not going to do anything in this area. I think it's still probably going to be an analog to digital uh, conversion. Or a uh, digital to analog or whatever. I can't see. Tomba. What's back there? There's a door, isn't there? Open the door. Tomba, open the open the door. God damn it. None of the doors open? I thought Oh man, that's stupid. Give me your hammer. Seagulls down in the town of Fishermen get their colors when they are cheeks. Okay. I guess he just explained why the seagulls were both red. So that's something. I don't think it mattered, though. <laughs> ah, son of a bitch. Okay, where do I go? Where do I go? Um. Hmm, all right, there's a ladder there. Oh, hi. Give me your pickaxe. The are blocking the outer pipes, causing the town's machines to overheat. I thought I got all of them. I already got all the... Wait. No, I know which one I missed. I'm pretty sure I know which one I missed. I missed the one at the very beginning of this area, didn't I? 
<sighs> it's the simplest answers that are often the hardest ones to comprehend. Yep, that's the one I missed. This one right here. God damn it. Cool, we got them all. Does that mean this... No, this door won't open until I'm, I'm able to hit that uh, switch, right? Yeah. Okay, cool. Now all the cappers are gone, so we can open the doors. Hey, dude. The machines are running. Thank you for getting rid of all the cappers. You're welcome. Stop asking me for favors. All the doors in the town should be unlocked now. Perfect. Make it so that it doesn't happen again. That's a terrible idea. Tomba, quick. Let's go to Tabby's. Go straight ahead up to two sets of stairs. Then look for the red door. Okay, red door up two sets of stairs. Come to think of it, I should get back into town too. All right, good to know. Wait. I have 100,000 points, don't I? Oh, I do! Hold on, let's go get that AP chest. It might have something good in it. Uh, we gotta go down. Yeah. And then we go up. Yeah. And then we go up. Okay. Oh, we got another pig nose panel. We don't know what those are for yet, but I'm sure we'll figure it out. Ow. Get ready to hear that a lot, by the way. That just like little loading uh, music. It's great. Every time you'll hear it. Nothing in here? Oh, wait. Oh, it's a big old thingy. Okay. Not so much of a tool shed then, is it? Are you the tool, sir? <laughs> I'd like to ride the trolley again. Yeah, would you? I'd like to ride the trolley again. That's your whole. Dialogue? All right, dude. The hell? Did you know? We have these bombs. They can blow anything up. Give me. They're so dangerous, we locked them up in the storage area by the pipes. Damn it. You can't even open the door without a hammer. Fuck. Well, I guess we go gotta go get bombs at some point. Hello, sir. Do you have a ticket? Oh, this... I just can't understand the creative urge. Oh. This man is quite handsome. I guess I can't do it without that clay spatula. Clay spatula, gotcha. Where did I put it? Hmm. The last pot I worked on, I gave to that miner in the house across the street. Okay, miner in the house across the street. All right, let's go pay that miner a visit and break his pots. You! Give me your pot. What do you think? Is this a great pot or what? A master potter here in town made it for me a long time ago. Yeah, I don't care. Let me break it. Ooh, look at that gloss and that form. It's wonderful. God damn it. Oops. I've got to get to work. So what they're doing here is they're setting up like, oh, this man loves his pot. We're going to break it and ruin his day. Oh, no. Well, let's break the pot. Fuck that guy. Can't imagine. What's that sound? Oh! Oh no! Oh no! My precious pot! 
I wrote this game. No, I didn't. It's all right. Things will, things will always break. Guys, eventually. I definitely did it on purpose. It's okay. It's not asking too much. Could you help? It might be better to leave. All right. Hey, can you let me? All right, let me buy. All right, cool. Go give the clay spatula back to the clay potter. Or whoever the fuck, whatever the fuck his name is. Cool, I made one person sad to make another person happy. That's how life works. Well, Get used to it. I, it uh, I remember it was in that park. Yeah, it was. Fuck you. Fantastic. Now I can make you another pot. Oh, I forgot something important. Oh, you did, did you? Actually, I don't have any of the precious clay. Oh. Oh, my mistake. I sometimes got clay from washing clumps of mud in the machine room's washing machine. Okay, we'll be going there at some point. Cool. Anyone in chat know the difference between mud and clay? Like, I mean, I get that they're they're different, like, but I don't understand what the difference is, you know? Because they both come out of the ground. They're both kind of made of dirt or whatever. Like, fundamentally, there's, there's got to be there's similarities, but what's the difference? Hey, travelers. No, it's just me. Your voice is much younger than your face. Oh wait, she works in a coal mine. No, that makes sense. My son heard of something that can heal wounds fast. He went to look for it and hasn't returned. <laughs> Sorry. I just got a spam call or spam text, excuse me. Hang on, let me uh Block and report that shit. God, stupid. Uh, heal wounds fast. He went to go look for it and hasn't returned. Okay. I know. Another quest. If you meet my son, I'm. All right, cool. Thanks. I'll be sure to look look for him. I guess. That's fine. All right, uh, how we doing here? Got anywhere else we need to go? No, okay, second level. Cafeteria? Oh, fuck yes. Food! I got some big pieces of meat! Oh, shit! <laughs> and a blue chest, which we can't open yet. What's this say? Steak sandwich to cure oily smear. Cook a big piece of meat in the burning machine to make a steak. Okay. If you're laughing or crying, try boiling potatoes to make a hashed potato sandwich. Okay. If you're invisible, try this. Make a dried fish sandwich in the town of the fishermen. See Ark for details. Okay. Interesting. What are you doing here? This isn't a playground, you know. Are you just swinging a knife around for fun? My dude? Good day, Mr. Chef. I've come back. Uh, okay, apparently Zippo's from this town, and we, we just, I guess, tagged along with him. Is that you, Zippo? If you're hungry, why don't you have some health dishes prepared from my secret recipe? The secret is, um, well, um, it's turmeric. I wish I could make it for you. Unfortunately, the stove is on the fritz and it won't light. Are those his lips? Uh. Chat. Chat. His lips. Oh no. <laughs> Dude, did you get stung by a bee or something? Do you have a recipe book there? If you bring me the ingredients, maybe I can fix something. 
Okay. God, those are some DSLs if ever I've seen them. Yikes. Oh, okay, there's a green chest in this in this one. Good to know. Can't go up that. Can't go up that. Of course I can't. They're down. They're not up. Huh? Okay. Caution overhead. Falling sand. Oh, okay. Fair enough. What's this? Oh. I'm sorry? <laughs> okay, I just have a wheelbarrow now. I got sand. What do I do with the sand? I don't... Oh. Oh, okay. I can fill in holes with the sand. Alright, good to know. Wow, more? Sheesh. Somebody was really proud of this sand mechanic. They had, they made me do it three times. All fill. We'll just leave that there for now. Hey, you. Go that way for the machine room. You'll find a ladder there. Okay. You can pass only if the hole's filled. Well, then fill the hole. I already filled the hole, but I'm just saying. Oh, this is Tabby's house. Tabby! I'm home. I don't know who you are, but I'm here. Just as I suspected, she isn't here. But her table is set. Wait a minute, Tomba. You hear that noise? I do. There's a home invader. Also, the table is set for three people. Suspicious. What the? Hey, hey, hey! What's all this ruckus? Wow! What is that? That guy didn't get paid enough. You took the words right out of my mouth. <laughs> That is one huge dirt ball. What did you call me? Why don't we use the washing machine in the underground machine room to figure out what it is? All right, fine. Okay. I don't want you to hurt. Let me know when you're ready. Make it quick, though. I want to see what... It's clearly a living creature because it's moving. I wonder what's under all that gunk. Cool. I don't care. Oh, wait. Care about this, though. Hell yeah, lunchbox. Got some healing, even though this game doesn't require it. Oh, what's this? Oh, looks like it's being repaired. The rails are still missing. Yep. All right, fair. Oh, it's Grand's house. Cool. Oh, hey, another uh, red chest. Oh, open it. Tomba. Tomba, your turn radius is so wide. There we go. We got it. All right. My boy Tomba just uh, really can't turn on a dime. It's just, He's just not built for it. Hello there. You're the shovel guy. In fact, this underground machinery works because I wanted a way to transport fuel. Oh, yeah? Hey, what's this? You got some good stuff. Let me have some of it. No, it's mine. 
Oh, fine. I guess we're giving it to him. Oh, you're just gonna throw it on the... Alright, well, fuck you. <sighs> he took my shit and then just threw it on a conveyor belt. Now it's in the dirt. Oh, something happening. Oh, no. Oh, no, he powered his death machine. Oh, wow. This should give me enough heat. Oh, all right. Well, that's 10,000 uh, points. Sweet. I'm happy for that, I guess. You I can know. ride the steam from the pipes up pretty high. Yeah. It's always a good idea to look out for billboards. What? Why? What do you mean billboards? Dude? What? <laughs> Very confused. All right, well, I filled in the hole, so I guess we're done up here. So now we go down here. Hi there. The machine room, pride of coal mining town. Are you? All right. The three machines are, from right, for washing, burning, and combining. Do you understand? Washing, then burning and combining. Okay, I think I understand. Oh, okay. I think I get it. All right. Uh... If I could boost the purity of the light of light in the hardonium, the compounds would make a light alloy. Right. With such an alloy, I could replace the underground trolley. It's getting pretty rickety. Okay. Fair. The evil pig spell keep the floor hot. Be careful or you'll get burned. Oh, okay. So don't touch... I just, I just touched it. <sighs> well, there are many kinds of clothes in the world. You can find bird clothes in the town of the fisherman. Already got it. I'm wearing him right now. Dude, already on it. All right. What do we got? What do we, what do we got here? Whoa. Who would have thought that something like this would be underground? Go figure. Pretty cool, huh? No, it's actually quite hot Let's in here. Find out what this thing is. Man, I'm making good time through this game. Oh, it's Charles. Charles? You know him? It's a small world. <laughs> yeah, this asshole oh, stole one of my bananas, then lost I'll his pants, then we, when I gave him his pants back, gave me a parasol, and then made me get him banana juice to, so that I could learn to swim. God, I hate this guy. Excuse me. I just remember. Thanks for all your help, man. Yeah, no problem. This cool. machine can wash and clean mud off things. Use it. You never know what treasure. Also, I just responded to a thanks a lot with a no yeah, no problem. Totally forgetting oh, which direction this conversation was going in. Fuck. Charles, what were you doing? All right, what we got? Zippo? Tomba? That's the what voice they gave Charles? Oh, no. Oh, no. Zippo? Tomba? We should be asking you. All I know is we found you bundled up in a lump of dirt. Dirt? Oh, yeah! I fell into some mud, so I was looking for somewhere to get it off. Okay. But by the time I got here, the mud dried, and I got stuck. Oh. And that's how you became that lump? Alrighty, then. Sure, that checks out, I guess. Out loud. I can't find that thing anywhere. What seems to be the problem? What? Oh, it's this guy. I can't find my hammer. A what? A hammer. You don't know what a hammer is? You know, a hammer. You hit things with oh, it. Oh, a hammer. When was the last time you saw it? Uh-huh. If I remembered, don't you think I would have it now? What? 
Someone, please help me find it. If Brand finds out I lost my hammer again, he'll fire me. No, you you were already fired. It was inevitable. You're unlikable, my dude. Toma, let's help him find it. Okay, don't you worry. I'm sorry, that was really harsh for some for some stupid reason. I'm sorry. I'm feeling a bit tired today, I think. Charles! Charles! It's always so impulsive. Try to remember. When was the last time you saw it? Well, let's see. I had it when I was working on the trolley. That's the last time I remember having it. Okay. So what you're telling me is it's by the trolley. It's probably the answer. Uh, all right, let's uh, let's wash some mud. God damn it! Washing machine. Okay. Can we wash the mud? Oh, I had to be on this side of it for some reason. Yeah, that checks out, I guess. Whatever. All right, what are we getting? Uh, some sort of metal? Low purity litamite, okay. Make a light alloy. Right, gotcha, okay. Now let's watch the other one. It's another rock! Cool. Aw, oh, fuck yeah, I'm being offered Salisbury steak for dinner. You know what that means, chat? It's, it might be, it might, we might be, uh, wrapping up the stream early or maybe, you know, cutting for, for dinner and then coming back. Uh, right. I just, I didn't check. I don't think I have, um, Yeah, no, I don't have anything else to uh, to toss into the machine. Okay. All right, we got to go back and get that guy's hammer. Do 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 do. Oh, okay, it looks like dinner's gonna be in 10 minutes then, so, uh, chat, we're gonna wrap up soon. Just so you're prepared for that. My dude, he... Uh, the hammer. I'm taking your hammer and you're not getting it back. You're the one that run off. What are you talking about? You're the one who went running off. What's the matter, Eddie? The foreman is looking for you. Foreman! You mean Grant? The foreman! Right. He said he saw Tabby. Tomba, hurry. Let's get this hammer back to Mole so we can find... Yeah, all right. Help! Help! Oh, no. I found your hammer. Speaking of which... Forget the hammer. This is more important. Okay, the hammer is forgotten. What were we talking about? What's the matter, Mo? Gran is trapped in the pipe area. Okay. Trapped? Trapped by a huge boulder. And that place is unstable. If it collapses, 
Okay, shit got serious because you you know because the music changed. Why can't we just use the hammer to break it? No, it's too big. We need something stronger. We need the bombs. Grand mentioned something about getting the bomb. Don't worry, you'll find. Thank. To activate the bomb, I'll see you guys later. Remember, use. Yeah, use the hammer. Okay, cool. Sure. Did we get a bomb detonator or something crazy like that? All right, whatever. All right, we're going to wrap here then. Uh, we will probably come back after dinner. So, uh, you know, keep an eye out. I'll tell us a notification in, in the Discord. So uh, join that if you haven't already. Uh, in the meantime, though, uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, YouTube. YouTube, I'm probably going to cut this and the next part together, um, so keep an eye out. I mean, I guess there's no keeping an eye out, just fucking... Uh, yeah. I'll stream some more after dinner. I'm feeling a bit tired, though, so maybe not. If you're watching this and, you know, this is where the video ends, then I guess like if you like this, com uh, subscribe, comment... Uh, join us on Twitch live at twitch.tv slash fantasy sauce and we have the discord link in the description Otherwise uh, Maybe there'll be more gameplay after this. Maybe not. We will uh, see Yeah If not good night everyone